Ernie remembered, Ernie being my husband, remembered sailing up here with a friend. And uh, everybody said, oh, of course, you'll want waterfront. And we said, not necessarily. We've been at sea for a long time, and we've lived in Sausalito out on top of, on top of the water. And so we took the realtor up in the air, airplane we had flown up. When we flew around over the valley out here, Ernie said, what about that place, to the realtor? And the realtor said, he said, well, that place might be for sale. I don't know. We'll see. So we packed up and went on home to San Francisco. And then a few days he called and said, well, it's yours. Eight sixty-five is when we built this house, which was in the same place that the old farmhouse was. So I got some graph paper out and I drew this square rectangle and I said, okay, let's draw what we would do with this house if we were going to remodel it. That's a good test of marriages, you know, is to, is to remodel or build something. But we, we passed. The entire farm is, is, has a preservation easement on it. You could already see the development happening and of course, if you have something like this, you don't want to lose it. So that was the natural thing to save it forever. You realize that <clears throat> if you have 20 acres or 10 acres, you can put those 20, 10 into the Preservation Trust, 200, 100, whatever, and you can write your own menu. You can say, well, there can be two houses on this. We'll know that this will stay the same. Thank goodness. And isn't that nice to know that it will always look like that?